Okay. So. Terrain. They like short grass. They need less long grass. They need more soil. More. Okay. Uh, I forgot that you can just kind of click on these and it'll do it. I thought you also had to like select the type of uh, terrain. Like based on the biome, but I guess I'm wrong. Okay, need more soil. Not sure where I want to build like their shelter zone at. Perhaps in like this corner here. I think it would be better if it looked like it was soily. Again, I'm trying not to make things look super terrible, but like I said, I'm not. <laughs> I don't have a good eye for this sort of thing at all. It says they could also do with some more rock. It doesn't bother them not to have it, but they just want to kind of break the terrain up a little bit. Can. I so this is going to be like their shelter over here. Rock would make a good base. They can use a little bit of sand. Mind it. Okay. That seems good. The shelter is large enough. That's good, because I didn't really know if it was going to be quite big enough. I was thinking... Let's push down over here. The grass kind of ruins it. That's okay, we can fix that. Kind of funny that you can kind of, like, reveal grass. Let's see. Some water in there. It's their terrain. Now do they want... It's the plants that you have to like search by biome and stuff. Fine by me. It's not like Zoo Tycoon where you can just grab the thing that they want. So let's see, we gotta go to Biome Africa. No, not in Africa. Biome Grassland and Tropical. <clears throat> okay, what do we got? That is Mega Giant. There's like a smaller Bobab tree, I would like that, but. Let's see, let's stick a uh, mangrove in the water, kind of like that, because it got its roots. Pretty good. I get a taller tree back in here. We don't want to block people's views too much. Now that looks super huge, but what we can do Advance, move it, and sink it into the ground. So that's not the right angle of rotation. That doesn't look 
too bad. We need to select one of the animals again, though. It's elephant grass in here. A custard apple tree. Got like vines. Maybe kind of a drier looking tree over here. Mess up. Is there something they don't really like? They don't like common reeds. This one? Why did that happen? Because I had I had the filter set. That shouldn't have happened. <laughs> All right, it's set where it is. But let's get the. Uh... We'll use this elephant grass instead. We'll do the kind of the same thing. We go. All right, that doesn't look too bad, actually. We need to get a hard shelter up. I don't know if there's a way to see like exactly how much they need. Some shelters. They have pre-mades. I can probably be happy with pre-mades. Well, not after like enormous. I might use them as kind of like a baseline at least, and then then I can work from them. Let's see, I want the advanced controls here. Place my controls, please. Advanced move is X. Unwanna raise platform is nice, but it seemed like it was a little bit too high for my taste. A little bit more of a turn. Ah. Press the wrong button at the wrong time. What we want to do is place it first. Then give them some bedding. Oh, that doesn't look good. What's funny is it's raising up to meet the bedding. This is strange to me because I sunk it into the ground lower. You think it wouldn't have to raise the raise the floor height there? I don't know if we can really fix that. I don't know, if we flatten from a point that's like... Why does that happen? Then just hit this with like a soil again here. Basically what I think is happening is because the animals can lay down in these beds, they have to have the ability to pathfind onto them. So I think that's why some of this grass just popped into existence here. Go 
other thing I was thinking was changing the side out to wood. So they have an area where they can have like a little bit of privacy. I don't know if privacy is something that's measured in this game, but I figure let's try to be as humane as we can be. Reasonably, at least, because I know this extremely basic shelter is probably pretty bad. <laughs> Even if it says the stats are good, it's probably not good. I don't think we can do anything about enrichment right now. We have climbing stuff, but that's it. And obviously these things don't climb. Golden Tigers must be who owned this uh, these animals before. Alright, what else do you want? Heart Shelter, I think it has to unpause to be able to notice it. It's definitely not enough though. So... I just copy this. Thank you. Oh, and also included my stuff, which is pretty nice. Turning little snapping off. I'm definitely sink it down pretty low. The terrain doesn't deform to try to meet it. There we go. Even that's probably not enough. It's good enough, but just uh, add some walls here let's see we want like a wood texture Usually these things are made out of materials that you already have. So, it's weird to me that this is like not the right color. Like I don't want this to end up looking like mega terrible. Essentially all we've got. Try to go into advanced placement like immediately here. Dang it. This is going to look too bad to work. <laughs> it's terrible. I really hate to add more. It'll look kind of a little bit absurd. But I think it's kind of what we have to live with. I 
Now they have enough shelter. That's all taken care of. They're going to need food and water, though. Well, they have water. That actually does count down there. We don't have to build a specific water trough if you put in that water. Then you need fed. I'm assuming they're more of a trough type of eating animal. I'll put it like next to this tree here. That. And then. We need. Let's see, I don't know if it's like part of habitats. even facilities like um, educational things yeah here we go this and there and also is that not actually go down Dang it. I always do that with this advanced placement I forget to click that plus sign to say yeah I'm good educational speaker can get attached to it I don't know if we can use them yet I think we have to uh... do some research before we can do that yeah so what the other thing I was looking for was a donation box people can donate Imagining this spot here is going to be decently used so they can watch the animals eat. And then also just up front here. And then I'll also put like a bench here. as well. Maybe security is in the game because there's cameras and everything. It's the same engine as Planet Coaster, I think, just revved up, so they should be able to just port things that they want in. Based on what I think I know. And people are coming in right away. And yeah, we're definitely going long this video. I apologize. Might even split it into two. All right. We have our first animals, the warthogs. So, we will call it an episode there. I don't know if we can get a good look at them here. Two of them are still standing in the same place. They decided they don't really want to move. Hopefully they're not, like, stuck. This one isn't. Are you two gonna move around yet? There they go. <laughs> it just took them a while. Pretty cool. Oh yeah, people are boarding around near where the feeder is, which is what I expected. Let's just make sure that the, the staff is doing their jobs here. Keeper. 
<clears throat> Where can I find you? I'd like to just like click to you. There you are. I want to habitat. There's just been some glitches with like uh keepers not feeding the animals. As uh they have a problem that is, <laughs> given it's a Zoom Tycoon game. Yeah, he doesn't seem too interested in feeding. Do it manually to start with, and then we should also get research going. Let's see. Oh, you could just click on them once and it would start research. So you have to drag a person around. There you go. Found Warhog, and that'll get us some. Maybe they're not hungry enough that he cares yet. Just in case, let's look at habitat again. Food. And is there... Yeah. Search by common warthog. That does say that they would feed them through that. I wonder if this thing is too big to... Like, it might cost too much money. It's, uh... Do that and try to just get, like, a little bit of a smaller one. Remember, if you enjoyed the video, to hit the like button. Keep the conversation going in the comments and subscribe if you want to see more. Until next time, I hope you have a good day.